Hey guys, so it's been a while since I last vlogged. With this whole stay at home quarantine stuff because of the coronavirus, uh, there just isn't much to update you guys about. And so I don't vlog a lot, but I did want to show you guys I have put together Grayson's Easter basket. Um, and so I wanted to show you guys what that looks like. We're actually going to be traveling to Toledo for Easter and Grayson's birthday. We're just going to have a small intimate party with close family because of the coronavirus so we're packing the car with his presents and his Easter basket but I wanted to show you guys and now for his birthday presents I already wrapped them which I didn't think I should have showed you guys before I wrapped them but I'll just tell you guys this one is a baby doll I just got it from Target I think it was like $14 and I really wanted one where the eyes would like open and close because I just feel like that makes it look more realistic. So I did get him one of those. That might be kind of weird that I got my son a baby doll, but we have a new baby coming and so he needs to practice. <laughs> and so I thought it'd make a good gift. This is a um, bath toy. It was at Target as well. It's just a bunch of cups that you stick to the wall and you like pour water through them and it like trickles down and then it like makes things move on the cups. It's really cute. And then the last gift that I have is a book. And we found this book at the library one day. We were just like killing time and Grayson fell in love with it. So I was like, I have to go get it. So I went and got it on Amazon. Um, I'll show you a picture of it here. It's like an A to Z book, but it just like has flaps and stuff, which Grayson loves. So those are my presents for him. I also have one more present that's at my parents' house. I will show you guys it when I get there because I still need to wrap it. It's um, I think it's a pl I think it's a kitchenette. I got it on Black Friday at Walmart for like twenty dollars, and when I got it, I was like, oh, I'll just save it for Grayson's birthday. And so I know I have it there, but I kind of forget like what exactly it is. So I will show you guys it once I get there, but I need to wrap that. But as for Easter basket, so last year my mom ordered this Easter basket for Grayson. It's super cute. I think she got it off Lillian and Vernon, I think. I, I can't remember, but it's cute. It's got his name on it. It's like super soft and fuzzy. Um, but here's some of the things that I got for him. So I got him, this was at the Target dollar spot. Um, it's one of those, well, it's Paw Patrol themed, which is really cute. And it's just one of those where... Um, the pen you color like the pages with the pen and then it like something appears and the best part about it is it's no mess like the pen only works on this kind of paper which I think is perfect because <laughs> Grayson does not stay on the paper. I got him um, this book. I am a big brother. Um, I saw it at Target and I almost bought it but Amazon had it for like a dollar cheaper <laughs> so I got it off Amazon and I think that would be really cute because he doesn't have any books about like becoming a big brother. So I, and he loves, loves books. So I thought that would be great. Um, I also got him um, sidewalk chalk and this is really cute. It's just in the shape of eggs, which I thought was cute for Easter. This was also at the Target dollar spot. It was a dollar. <laughs> so it's really cheap. I've never given Grayson sidewalk chalk before. It does say ages three and up, but I mean, we're quarantined and stuck at home. So I figure maybe he'd like something like this. If not, it was a dollar. So it's not that big of a deal. And then finally this, <laughs> this is at Target. This is like in the back of the store with like all their um, Easter stuff so the things in it right now but when you push it it like lights up and spins and Grayson actually saw this and was playing with it <laughs> and um, I ended up taking it from him and like hiding it and I put it in the basket and he was mad because he wanted to keep playing with it so I think he's really gonna like it of course he's not gonna remember it 
Like his memory isn't that good, but I think he's really gonna like this. So yeah, that's what's in his Easter basket. I didn't do any candy or I guess I could have put like melts or um, puffs in there because those are some snacks that he really likes. But I was like, you know, he has that stuff all the time. I thought getting him like gifts would be more fun. And they're just like little knickknacks. Like I said, most of the stuff I got from like the Target dollar spot section. So I didn't pay much money. The book was like four dollars so I didn't spend a lot on him just because I mean Easter is the day after his birthday and he's still so little like he does not care that much um even if, if I would have gotten him nothing he would have been fine with it like he just doesn't understand like what's going on so Easter will look a little different this year just because um, obviously all the churches are closed because of the stay-at-home order and things. So we won't be going to church. So I don't know if we'll really get dressed up. We are doing the gender reveal on Easter. So that will be fun. Another thing we can celebrate while we're in Toledo with family. That will be really fun to do. I'm excited to tell you guys what the gender of the baby is. So I just wanted to show you guys the presents and Easter basket before I were to load it in the car. I've been hiding the Easter basket all day because I just don't want Grayson to see it. The presents, whatever, they're wrapped. But the Easter basket, like, I wanted it to be a surprise for him. So, yeah, that's what we're doing. I'm hoping to vlog a lot this weekend um, for his birthday and and Easter but you know every time I say I'm going to do that and then I just get too busy and I don't so I'm hoping I can record a lot but don't hold me to it if I don't um, but yeah I just wanted to show you guys what I got